features of renaissance in this chapter the features are classified into four the first feature humanism second scientific spirit third spirit of inquiry and the last rationalism and i will be discussing this four features the first one humanism medieval period all human activities centered around religion as it was considered crucial to human existence so people at that stage were more concerned with religious beliefs such as life after death rather than worldly affairs but renaissance thinker believed in human needs emotions and life on earth they gave more importance on everyday life like joy sorrow desire and creativity of human this way of thinking was called humanism the second feature scientific spirit renaissance scholars adopted scientific approach to learning during this period there was strong desire to ask questions and to find out the answer in a scientific manner through observation experimentation and logical thinking they believed in finding out the truth about the environment and themselves in a scientific manner through observation experimentation and logical thinking the third feature is spirit of inquiry and it was a continuing desire of the renaissance period people to explore the unknown and seeking knowledge during the renaissance and this led to great progress in the field of science technology and paved the way for exploring experimenting and discoveries new reason were discovered that was unknown to the european because of this arch of this carnes to know and explore the world the last feature rationalism people believed and accepted facts on rational thinking the thinkers of that period believed that life should be based on reasons and logic rather than emotions or religious belief impact of the renaissance this scientific spirit of inquiry led to many inventions and discoveries which in turn improved the quality of life new voyages and discoveries resulted in interaction between people from around the world during this renaissance many changes took place in the european economy setting into process of the colonization of asia africa and latin america the impact of renaissance can also be seen in the paintings of leonardo da vinci he was a genius of all time who was an expert 
painter, sculptor, architect, musician, mathematician, philosopher, and scientist. One of his famous painting, Mona Lisa. While painting this portrait, how closely Leonardo da Vinci studied the human anatomy. You see the fingers and the muscles. Even we can feel the muscles of her fingers and look at her face. How beautifully it is expressed. The most important development was the use of representing three-dimensional objects on a plane surface so as to give the right impression of their height, width, depth and positions. And this all started from the Renaissance period. And among the greatest artists of that period, as we know, one of them is Leonardo da Vinci and the other is Michael Angelo. He was an Italian painter, sculptor, architect and poet. And he is famous for his painting on the ceiling of the Sistine Chapel in the Vatican. Among his other famous sculptures are Python and David. Sculpture of Renaissance period, we can see how beautifully the human body is depicted. That period also developed sculpting into an art form and the first person to develop this art was Lorenzo Givarti. He was a goldsmith and sculptor. He was the first person to develop the sculpting into an art form. And his famous presentation is Gate of Paradise. Here, in this Gate of Paradise, we can see how beautifully sculpting is done in the art form. One of the greatest sculpture of the early Renaissance period was also Tantelo. He revived the classical sculpture, for example, Saint Mark and Equestrian, the statue of Gata Maleta of Saint George. But the uncontested master of high renaissance sculpting was Michelangelo and Paita is considered to be the greatest of his early work. But the masterpiece is David. In the field of architecture, Renaissance saw the beginning of new form, leaving behind the old style of architecture.
the new style was based on study of greek and roman architecture round arches imposing domes and orderly arrangement of columns were the remarkable features of renaissance architecture and the finest example of this style is the saint peter's basilica in vatican city apart from these changes and development in the field of art architecture sculpting literature also witness various changes during renaissance the spirit of inquiry led to the demand for books and the invention of printing press by jonathan gutenberg brought many revolutionary changes in learning for centuries before the invention books were handwritten and availability was limited earlier books were written in latin and was understood only by a small section of society the renaissance authors wrote in italian spanish france german and english one of the most important works of the renaissance period was the divine comedy by dante william shakespeare wrote in english and john milton wrote in several language in about various aspect of human life in keeping with the spirit of renaissance in science and technology during renaissance led to many discoveries and progress in the field of astronomy nicolas copernicus proved that the earth rotate on its axis and revolves around the sun he challenged the traditional thought of the roman catholic church which taught that the earth was at the center of the universe galileo invented the telescope a century later and this proved that copernicus was right in the field of biology william harvey discovered the system of circulation of blood from the heart to other parts of the human body sir isaac newton proved that all the celestial bodies move according to the laws of gravitation and microscope and the thermometer were invented in the 17th century prince henry the navigator of portugal financed many expeditions and sent sailors to explore the west coast of africa in the year 1488 bartholomew diaz sailed down the west coast of africa and reached the southern tip of Africa and named the Cape of Good Hope. In 1947, Vasco da Gama sailed to the eastern coast of Africa and crossed the Indian Ocean, reaching Calicut in India in the year 1498. In the year 1492. Christopher Columbus an Italian explorer discovered America